Hello guys and welcome to another video. It's the Mitch of a Gamer here and today we're gonna be playing Stumble Guys and I have a challenge to for me to try. So it will be the no dive challenge. And basically on this thing I just have to qualify and do not dive at all. No punches, no hugs, no kicks uh, are allowed, and also, uh, because this might take for ages, I will do it a bit different from what the other content creators do. So, I will put myself a number of matches, let's say 4 or 5, let's go for 5, and every time I qualify, I will take a point, and in the end, we will see how many points do I have. And maybe I will try this again on a future, like month, or like once. Like I will try it now in March and maybe again on May and see if I have any progress. So I think this is a very good one, is it? So, I will say five matches. I'm gonna load into the first one and the real Sarah, as I said, I cannot use any special emotes. I can like walk and jump, but not punch. Yeah, sorry, not punch. I cannot die. So we're gonna see how this will go. Uh, and I'm also try not trying this in the beta. I want to do this in beta, but most of the people there are bots, and it will not be very like good. So I didn't dive, I just jumped. So there are maps like this, where sometimes you can just jump and slide. Like now, I just jump and slide. So this map maybe is a bit easy, if I do not fall. Does it work here? It does. I, cannot, I can jump once here. So, okay, one point for me, I'm gonna write in a random paper like one, or actually, because it's harder, let's, I qualify for the first round, I take one point. If I qualify again, I will take two more points. It makes sense. And if I win the round, I will get three, because the difficulty goes up, because, yeah, there are, there are less players, but there are less spots. So it is harder. So this is what I'm gonna do. So if I qualify now, I will be I will take two more points, and I will count them in the when the video ends. So we have block dash. We have to survive more than others. Oh, okay. I just died. I just died. I. I don't know what I, I was thinking, but I died. So this base does not count. So I did the worst mistake of the world. So I got only one point from this round. Let's go to the second one. Okay, I wrote in the second round and we have jungle roll, which I think may not be so hard without diving. I just need to remember the rules and do not do any stupid things like the previous time. So this part is gonna be a bit slow because I cannot dive, I have to go the normal way. A lot of people are going the normal way, but if I fall, I lost the entire game. I have not. Uh, I have to try to not fall, and here I cannot go from there, I wait, jump, jump. So this is really going very good. One, two, three, four. So yeah, I managed to full qualify. So for second round, I qualified in the first round. So after that, we get laser tracer. Let's see how we're gonna go. Again, I need to remember to not dive. It is not hard challenge, it is most like remembering the rules. 
because I always play, I dive like 10 million times in one level and I just died for no reason. Okay, never mind. So maybe no gun in case has some difficulty. Let's see what I could do in the third round. Actually, before that, let me claim a skin. It will be cool, I guess, to add it to the video. I hope I get something I do not have. Of course, and common. And I do not have it, so we're fine. So that's going to be much. So again, we got Junk Roll, which I think we qualified the previous time, so maybe I will be able to do it just fine again. Again, I need to be careful on this part to not fall. Uh, I'll go straight. Have to go this way. A lot of people are with me. Subscribe, subscribe, sub. How it's called? Surprisingly, I thought more of them were using the trick, like go from this corner and like. Oh, I got kicked. Okay, I still think I can do it. Yeah. Oh, it was. I I could not double jump. So. Okay, it's way way worse than I, hard than I thought. So this time we've got spin go round. It may be a bit terrible at the start, but a lot of people do mistakes here. So it. It will be easy, I don't know. Let's just see and hope if we go just fine. So jumping... I can jump, which sometimes I forget I can jump for a reason. But this is not part in the rules, so... Okay, let's go on this platform. Jump again, and this was way easier than I thought. So let's just go to the second round. I will write the one point again now and go to the next one. Okay, now I have a good bombardment. Which, if I do not get like cut from the mainland, the main like the place where all of these blocks are, I will be fine, I guess. I can be, I want to be places like this because it's harder to fall and. Yeah, I may get kicked or something, but I have to remember who is the puncher, so that dude... No, I was about to fall there. Is he a puncher? I don't know. Oh, this was the worst thing ever. Did you see that? He kicked and fell into the water. Okay, never mind. Now I score two points. One and two equal three, and let's go to the next one. So now with laser tracer for the final one, with I think it's more difficult because if I do not dive, I can just get stuck on people and just die instantly, like the previous match which I had to play with that. Sometimes I feel like if you like spam jump. It, li it really like defends you from opponents, but you cannot get punched or kicked or whatever. Because if you do, your game might end fast. So just jump for no reason. So I'm doing very good. I don't think I will win because yes, it is a difficult map. I don't know how to play it well. And I cannot dive, so this can get even worse. But personally, I think the worst map would be Honey Drop because you cannot do anything without diver. You need to travel to like jump on blocks and stuff. Oh, I'm gonna die! I don't know why I survived. I really thought I would die, but maybe I'm better than this because. I cannot die, so I did not take any risks. Oh, just at that point! Oh, okay. 
So I got 3 points 1 and 2 from this round, it was it better? Now we will, we will get the 5th and final round. So this time we got Tidefall and I think this is a bit bad because we cannot jump uh, far and I already fell. Okay, can I jump at least one block? I can, but it's so close. Okay guys, just walk. Okay, it was... If I did not get kicked or something, there were some people who kicked, but they did not affect me. Yeah, this was quite easy. So, one point and let's go to the next one. Okay, we got floor flip and I think floor flip is the worst thing for the second round. I may not even be able to beat it with dive, not even without it. This part is horrible. Oh, I managed to pass that. If you manage to pass this and there are not a lot of people in front of you, you may have a chance, but there are a lot of them and I cannot dive to overtake them fast. So I really didn't need a lot of them to die. And a lot of them just fall down. Maybe I can't do it. But also the final final thing is gonna be a mess right here. I really need this to be up because I cannot die. Oh, I did it! No, 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 no. Okay. I want to kill this guy. Who was this guy? If I do not qualify, it would be his fault. Okay, this time I will, I will, I will, I will. I did. Nice. So, I don't really get, uh, get why these people do this. Like, why should he, like, grab it from the back? But, okay. Let's go to the next one. Okay, I didn't even need to pause that, just pass one second and show the map, but Honey Drop, I told er earlier I think this is the hardest map, because you can only get on close like tiles and it's not ideal. You see, if it was for the challenge I would have got to these tiles probably, ex but I couldn't. So, now I have to go like, I'm on one floor down, but this is not hard, this is not like bad always, because you do not have others that can punch you and do stuff like that. And also because I'm playing from my computer, because my, my PC, because my phone died. I, di I have not set any controls for the camera to turn and I do not turn it. Ah! Okay, never mind. So I qualified in the second round, so I take two more points there. I forgot to write that down. So, time to count. So basically, I got one point in the first round, one in the second, one plus one equals two. On the third, I got nothing. On the fourth one, I got three, one, and two, and on the fifth one, I got three as well. So three plus three equals six, plus two equals eight. So for this, I got eight points, and I will probably try this again because I think I could have done better. But this was it for this video. I hope you enjoyed. Like and subscribe, comment, and share with your friends if you did. And see you in the next one. Goodbye.